Yo guys, what's up? We are back in BMX Streets today and we are going to be finishing up all the challenges in the spillway section. If you need any help with the challenges in this area, you can check out my previous video, which I'll leave linked in the description, or this video will potentially have the answers you seek. We are gonna come down here and start this challenge right here, which is actually extremely difficult. All right, so we have to do a perfectly tweaked backflip turn down over this whole gap here. We could just do a turn down over it to complete the basic, a perfectly tweaked turn down to do basic and am, but we're gonna go for everything. So we're actually gonna pedal way back here. Yeah, that one's that one's pretty tough, I can't lie. All right, at this point with my last video, we have done every sort of challenge except for one, and that is a drift challenge. This is the first one we got in the game, so we're going to go ahead and hit this one right here. All right, so this is the first drift challenge. There's a bunch of these in the game, and basically the main objective here is we have to drift or skid into these cones. Hitting these cones with our back wheel will give us more time, which will hopefully allow us to finish this race. If we can get this one here, I'm gonna go a little bit slower here because I'm really bad at drifting. As you can see, when I skid into these cones, we get a little bit of extra time. The sound cues make this a little scary to play, but there we are. Fully completed our first drift challenge. And in this challenge right here, as you can see, we have the 67 performance cassette. I believe this is actually the first cassette hub that you unlock in the game. So if up to this point, you were kind of like, what the heck, this is a free coaster only game. No, you actually just have to unlock a cassette hub to put on your bike. So if we change parts, we go into wheels, rear hub, right at the top here, we have the performance cassette. We'll go ahead and equip that. So now when we're pedaling, we have a cassette. There we go. And just before we leave this area and go to the next, there's actually another hidden gap up here. The X on this one is looking a little different than the first one we saw, but this is how some of them look as well. There's the X, we just have to find the takeoff, and the takeoff is actually up top over there, so we actually have to run around, or at least that's how I know how to get to it. Come up here, right over here. Oh, and there's oh, another box. Okay, there's a bunch more cassettes for us. Maybe you can get some more through that. I don't know why it's those boxes are doing that, but as we can see, here is the takeoff. We have to take off right here and land in that X. So if we go straight off here, we kind of have to go a little bit to the left. But before we do that, I'm gonna walk right over here, drop down here, and we have another box to collect. All right, let's hit this gap here. First try, potentially. Hey, there we go. I don't know if we're landing this. <laughs> no. Okay. All right, we gotta move on to the next area for the last couple challenges we have in the spillway section. Oh, there's actually another box. We gotta grab it right over here. parts cool all right moving on all right flip all right we're gonna want to come right up here to the left a quick little nose manual up these stairs right here we can unlock this fast travel location which i have already done and that's gonna bring us to this area right here if you guys played skate 3 this this area is gonna look pretty familiar to you and we've got two challenges here we're gonna start with this one right here et phone home all right so we have to hit a toothpick on the rainbow rail do a backflip either in or out of that and get a thousand points let's see if we can get that Okay, that was, <laughs> that was a little sketchy, but we got it done. I think we did a backflip triple bar into the tooth. All right, now we're gonna do this guy right here. 
Do I get this for free? <laughs> okay, come on. All right, we have to smith this rail, hit a drop in. We have to do three whips on that hip over there. We also have to do an invert and we have to get three perfect tweaks. Okay, should be easy enough. One perfect tweak. Let's get that triple whip right here. Okay, what else could I get a perfect tweak on? Another toboggan, sure. And then we'll just get a perfect tweak on this invert, maybe? Oh wait, I need more points before we do that. Let's just like, free roam a little bit here. Make sure we can get these points. Wait, I think I have to do the points in these areas, right? That would make sense. Front flip bar action. There we go. Okay, now we just gotta get one perfect tweaked invert. There it is. Boom! There we go. Yeah, so from here, you're gonna wanna go down here. And I mean, this is how you leave to get to the rest of the map. It's a nice random little uh, rail you could session here. A complete dead end over there. Now we've got a fork in our little path here. If we go to the left, that is going to take us to the rest of the map. But we're actually going to move to the right. It's going to look like a dead end. This is definitely a visual bug, but we can actually ride over here. This is going to take us to that infamous tunnel park that we've seen MASH Games post on Instagram and Discord and whatnot. First, we're going to climb up right here and grab this box. Just before we do this uh, challenge, I think I have two clips in here from when I was playing multiplayer with uh, MASH. I got a really sick wall ride backflip transfer, and then I got another funny clip where I was doing a flare transfer over MASH, and he actually jumped off his bike and grabbed me, which was pretty funny. But I actually, I don't think I've done this Mikey Park Jam before, so let's go ahead and get this done. All right, see if we can uh, get these letters here real quick. Little bar over that guy. Little flare whip. Look back. Bar tuck. Okay, missing that other letter here. Little bar can can action. Little air to fakey. Fakey we whip bar. Let's see if we can get this X here. Oh! Have to go for the fakey, the fakey X. Oh my god, we're so close. Come on. And there it is, okay. And then what, we had another one right over here, right? Bam. Look back. Our down whip. Dude, we're literally kissing the M. Come on now. <laughs> Doing everything in my power to get this this M. The Grizzair. Ice pick the bar, let's go. We gotta hit a wall ride flip. Okay, that was <laughs> that was really weird. Oh, okay, there we go. Cool. Anyways, that is Mikey's park jam. We'll come out here and show you guys the exit. And also another box, of course. There's the boxes are everywhere in this game. It is a bit of a maze to get out of here. This is definitely an interesting <laughs> way to get us out. A little rail hop, we're gonna turn right. Come right over here. Press Y to pick up. And then yeah, we can get into the rest of the map. Some of the things in the distance are Obviously not loading in because you're not meant to see that far. But that whole spillway section to this big area. And then, yeah, we can ride all the way down to that boat way down there. So, anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and we will be seeing you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys. Have a good one. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.